really excited today because I'm coming to visit one of my good friends, Jack, and his beautiful dog, Arrow. Hello, Arrow boy! Oh. <laughs> so excited. How are you going, How are you going? Jack? Welcome. Oh, thank you. How are you, mate? So I've come around to their place today because poor little Arrow gets a little bit stressed out at the clinic and can get a little upset too sometimes. So I think this will be much more relaxing for him. Oh, keep moving, keep moving. Boy. Come on. Hey, you big boy. You a big boy, aren't you? Arrow's three and he, uh, he's very well loved. He's a Rottweiler, obviously. He's a massive boy, but um, he's very friendly. So we're very lucky. Uh, we've got a new baby and he's just a gem with him. In the area, he gets pats every time he goes down the street and he's the, he's the star of the show. How can you say no to that place? Oh. You can't, eh? He's a big sook. <laughs> you are a big sook, I think, Arrow. How's Arrow been? Yeah, he's, he's been great. Yeah. Um, no real issues. All right, well, have a little look at him um, and then we'll, yeah, chat about a plan for him yeah. on the flea treatment side of things. So let's have a little look at you, mate, OK? So I'm just doing a very basic exam of Arrow today. I don't want to push my luck too much with him and cause him any distress. So we'll just keep it nice and simple. Good boy. Good boy, mate. Oh, he's so much better at home. Oh, he's yeah. so relaxed. Beautiful heart. Beautiful. Hey, can I lift up this leg? Oh, what a good boy. Hey, it's a heavy leg. Help? It is a heavy leg. Oh, okay. All right. We'll leave it at that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, he's looking pretty fighting fit. Great. He could probably lose a little bit of weight, but I don't want to go too invasive with our physical sure. exams. I don't want to upset him today. Yep. So what I think we do is we'll have a little chat about the plan on how to tackle fleas. All right. Good boy. Beautiful. I know you're a good boy. You really want to be on the preventative approach as far as fleas go. They are everywhere in the environment. So anywhere where another dog or a cat has been that might happen to have some fleas on them, mm -hmm. there's going to be eggs in the environment and those adult fleas will then jump on. Even if you've never had an issue before, all it takes is going into a high burden environment. I actually saw a case the other day um, of this exact thing happening and a dog came into the clinic completely um, riddled in fleas but had never had an issue. They hadn't used prevention yep. before and then they had a huge infestation. The house yeah, was... Like that. Yeah. yeah. So I'll, I'll show you this video because it's really quite crawling oh. over. I think it's really important to educate pet owners about fleas because it can become a really big problem, particularly if we're not on the preventative approach. You can end up with a huge flea burden in your home environment and they can survive for up to a year. So then it's a real struggle to get things back under control. Once you've got that problem, it's so much harder to manage. So... Yeah, we don't want that. Yeah, don't so let's that. get something on board for you, mate. Hey? It's great to have Danny here just to give some information about the flea prevention that we should be doing considering how often he's going to the park and the beach and seeing other dogs. I've got a product here, Advocate, and I'd recommend that as a great option for Arrow and it's something, it's nice and simple because you just pop it on the coat, yeah, so it's right. a spot on treatment yeah. once a month and then you're, you're covered for everything. So it covers not just the fleas, it covers your mites, lice, intestinal worms, heartworm, everything. Yeah. So it's a really okay. good all-rounder. We used to get tablets as well, I think that was fleas, maybe it was ticks, but he wouldn't eat them. So oh, you put it okay. And you just eat around. There you go. So, so that, spot yes, on the really spot on will be yeah. much easier for you, mate. Hey, perfect. Because arrows over forty kilos, we're going to need to use two of these yep. tubes. Okay. All right, and then we just spot them over three different spots along his back. Not food, mate. I'm sorry. We'll give you a treat in a minute. And then we've just got to part the hair. A bit of skin for you. So you just dribble that along the skin. So just make sure you part the hair so you can actually see that skin. Yeah. Good boy, almost done. One two. Good boy. Okay, so we'll put that second one on now. Yep. Oh, it's okay. Good boy. You're doing so good. Lots of fur. See? Most of it's on the floor now. Oh, done! Good boy. Easy good peasy. Boy. Good job, mate. Hey? Good boy, Arrow. Hey? Well done. I'm confident now that I've helped Jack come up with a plan that's going to protect Arrow from those pesky fleas and parasites from here on. He's such a beautiful boy. I know, I know. We're very, very lucky, I must say. Yeah, yeah. he's just a big teddy bear, eh? Hey? Good boy, Arrow. Good boy.